Hello guys and welcome to the Blue Review. Today we are talking about The Doors. So here's the thing. I'm kind of a sucker for biopics. I'll watch this about any of them. I, I'm just fascinated by them. But this one here, it's a piece of shit. For the first half hour of the movie, it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. It's one of the most difficult films I've seen to follow. It's just like scenes, they just sort of happen. They sort of come out of nowhere and they don't really feel like they connect to anything. It's just sort of like a, a bunch of random scenes just sort of thrown out there. Uh, it was almost like Stone was more interested in seeing people getting stoned than he really was about telling the stories of the of the door. And like Jim Morrison never like actually speaks like, hey guys, what's going on? Or, you know, it's, I, everything he says sounds like a fucking poem. And if somebody actually talked that way, you'd just be like, shut the fuck up. I mean, basically, if this was an accurate portrayal of Jim Morrison, he was whacked out of his fucking mind 24 hours a day, seven days a week. It's just, whatever. Watching this movie is like sitting in a room with a friend who's like totally wasted out of his mind, coming up with the most retardedest ideas that, that don't even make sense. Like, oh, dude, we should, we should fucking totally bottle the mountain air. People would buy air. What? Shut the fuck up. But if you're stoned too, then you're like, yeah, fuck yeah, man. Air. People buy air sitting here. You know, you have a drool coming out of your mouth. You're going to have to be stoned to make any sense out of this fucking movie whatsoever. So if you decide to watch The Doors, do it fucking high as shit, I guess, because this movie is retarded. It is boring. It is stupid, and it doesn't, <laughs> whatever, it's not really about the doors, it's about, hey, look, Jim Morrison was a fucking drunk, and a dope head, yay, <sighs> but as far as the visual quality is concerned, it was pretty outstanding, there were a lot of really standout moments, I'm going to give it four stars, the audio on this thing, 7.1, uh, DTS HD surround can't get better than that so I mean if you like the movies The Doors uh, go check it out I think it's a pretentious piece of shit but you know peace